So I thought I'd make a little video showing my uh, automatic feeder setup that I have for the fish now. Uh, it's a five gallon bucket. Uh, this is a shroud I have up under here. Up under there, that's a uh, automatic feeder for deer. Uh, a lot of hunters use it. Uh, it was $25 ish on Amazon. So I put fish food in here. There's a hole in the bucket. And then automatic feeder kicks on periodically. And I have it set for 10 o'clock at night. Um, kicks on and it spins. Now they're designed to spread the feed out a lot more. So I put this little shroud so it drops everything into the fish tank. Uh, that allows, you know, I don't get spray everywhere. Uh, I have a little video showing it going off at night. So as you can see, it works pretty well. Um, and some of it flows into my sump tank, make sure I have enough food for the fish in there. And a lot of it now is getting some humidity, so it drops pretty quick. So I'm getting plenty of food in the fish tank itself. Um, so, but everything is looking good. Well, the clarity is not quite as good as it was, but I had to do some cleaning on the um, filter up top. Um, also, I had a couple drain issues, so I went through and flushed some of the piping. Um, just to make sure that I wasn't going to have any more issues with that. Uh, the tomatoes are looking really good. There's one of them. It's about the size of a golf ball now. Um, but yeah, the actual plants themselves are looking nice and healthy. Uh, as you see, I lost the top plants on the NFT system. Uh, I had an incident where it dried out, and I lost those plants, but those basil are doing fine in the midsection. Uh, like I said, I cleaned this out yesterday. I got that nice and clean, and there's actually quite a bit of sediment in there, so I'm glad I got to it before uh, any more built up. I think it was causing some issues throughout the system. Uh, I'm going to do a lettuce harvest. It's getting pretty tall. Some of it's seeded. I pulled the seed caps off. But uh, basil's looking good. Parsley's looking good there. Um, looks like something was in here last night and knocked some stuff over, but... doing good. You can see this other set of basil. The cucumbers are coming back and alive. I have a real nice cucumber in here somewhere. And a nice cucumber in here. Um, right here. It's running. Where is this thing running? Oh, here it is. Nice cucumber in here. It's working its way out. Some more there. So that's doing well. These tomatoes are looking good. They're starting to set. So all in all, everything went pretty well. And uh, hopefully, I'll start getting some tomatoes setting within the next couple weeks. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Like I said, everything's going going well except for just a couple of drain issues. But it's to be expected when I have this many fish in the system. Uh, but I hope you all enjoyed the video. Do, go ahead and subscribe for more and I'll keep you updated and y'all have a good day.